Who are the Salesians of Don Bosco? The Salesians are comprised of nearly 30,000 priests, brothers, sisters, and novices serving in the spirit of our founder, Don Bosco, an Italian priest who devoted his life to helping orphaned and vulnerable children. Since our beginnings in 1859, the Salesians of Don Bosco has become the second largest order in the Catholic Church. St. John Bosco was born on August 16, 1815, and at nine years old had a dream calling him to dedicate his life to educating poor and disadvantaged youth. In 1841, he was ordained a priest and in 1859 established the Society of St. Francis de Sales, popularly known as the Salesians. Today, we are located in more than 130 countries and our programs affect the lives of millions of impoverished children and families. The Salesians believe that every child deserves the opportunity for education and a chance at a better life. Our missionaries live and work within the communities they serve, many located in the poorest places on earth, and provide programs to children regardless of race or religion. We operate more than 5,500 schools and youth centers around the world, serving millions of students each year and helping break the cycle of poverty. Continuing education provides young adults with the skills they need to find decent jobs and become self-sufficient, contributing members of society. Twenty years ago, Faisan graduated from the Don Bosco Technical School in Bangkok, Thailand. Today, he pays that opportunity forward by training and employing underprivileged youth in coffee production and retail services. His company, Di Bosco Coffee, has grown from its humble beginnings as a single shop in Chiang Mai into a global brand, recognized by leading hotels and restaurants. One of the biggest struggles in underdeveloped countries is the amount of children living on the street. More than 330 shelters and homes meet an array of basic needs by providing safe havens, food, and clothing. These programs help to counsel, stabilize, and educate homeless youth by opening the doors to new opportunities. Efforts are also made to reunite street kids with their families when possible. Ten-year-old Hector, who had been living on the streets, arrived at the Don Bosco Project Mano Amiga in Bolivia five years ago, with no apparent relatives or record of his past. With no family or home of his own, he had wandered in and out of shelters his entire life, unwilling or unable to even speak. Today, Hector is thriving in his basic studies, especially reading. The Salesians of Don Bosco are considered the largest private provider of vocational and technical training in the world, with nearly 1,000 vocational, technical, professional, and agricultural schools. Adriana arrived at the Child Reception Center of Borgo Regazza in Rome with nothing but the shoes on her feet and the clothes on her back. She slept on the street, begged for money, and engaged in petty theft in order to eat until she was referred to the Child Reception Center for a job training and placement program. Today, Adriana supports herself, her mother, and her younger siblings with the income she earns working in a local bakery. Salesian Missions cares about the growth and development of young girls and women. By providing women with education, support, and skills training, families are made stronger and allow women to have better jobs. Innocentia Villacasa is a woman in a man's world. A successful welder who helped build the Mobella Stadium, home to South Africa's 2010 FIFA World Cup, as well as the Madupi Power Station in Limpopa. 
She's also an instructor at Don Bosco Educational Projects in the suburbs of Johannesburg, where she reminds all of her students, and especially the girls, to aim higher. Students cannot learn on an empty stomach. Our food assistance programs feed students, reducing child malnutrition while increasing school attendance. Daguna arrived at our feeding center in Dila, Ethiopia on a hot summer day with his mother and younger brother in search of food. He and his family soon became regulars at the feeding center. One year later, after months of meals, medicine, vitamins, and lots of love, Daguna almost doubled his weight, no longer lives in isolation, and is attending school every day. With its global reach, Salesian Missions is perfectly positioned to aid in emergency relief during times of natural disasters, traumatic circumstances, and civil unrest by launching special fundraising drives during humanitarian emergencies. In the early hours of April 25, 2015, a 7.8 magnitude earthquake struck Kathmandu, Nepal, leaving more than 8,000 dead, close to 20,000 injured, and more than 500,000 homeless. Salesian missionaries were immediately on the scene, providing any assistance they could while risking their own safety. Our work in Nepal still continues today with rebuilding and education. The global pandemic has challenged all our lives, but it is the poorest among us that suffer the most. Our Salesian missionaries are on the front lines setting up hand washing stations and providing face masks, personal protective equipment, food, medicine, and other vital supplies. They are also adapting to this new way of life by providing education and supportive programs using innovative ideas and technologies. With more than 150 clinics, hospitals, and dispensaries worldwide, many of which are located in rural communities, Salesian missionaries are able to care for the sick and provide vital, life-saving medicine. It's hard to believe that an estimated 768 million people globally lack access to clean water. Instead of attending school, many children are forced to walk for hours to collect water. Unfortunately, too often this water is contaminated and seriously sickens those who consume it. There is an immense need for clean water in many of the countries where our missionaries serve. Therefore, Salesian Missions has made clean water and sanitation systems a top priority. Recently, students and staff at Don Bosco High School in Nahotakota, Malawi, celebrated the installation of a new community water well which was funded by the Salesian Missions Clean Water Initiative. The water supply from the town had been unreliable, resulting in a lack of water for cooking and drinking, as well as use in personal hygiene, which is a health hazard. Thanks to the transformative vision of our founding father, we have succeeded in helping millions of marginalized youth and families around the world. Our Salesian missionaries continue the legacy that Don Bosco worked so hard to build, lighting the path towards a much brighter future for so many disadvantaged people, providing the education and training they need to forever break the chains of generational poverty.